tonight we, you didn't have your best stuff. What does it say about your team, where it's come from, and your goaltending, where it's come from, that you're able to get a win on that? Uh, I, guess. I think we're all really happy with the Clemens game tonight, including his teammates. You know, it's uh, uh, one of those ones where he was a difference maker. So um, they, they put a lot of pressure on us, and we were able to withstand it and uh, uh, find a way to win, which is. I just feel this team deserved that game as well as our fan base, so uh, nice one for us. When you're up against, and I don't want to get you in trouble or anything, but you had a lot going on there late in the game with calls that's been going on lately. How difficult is it for you as coach to kind of work through those things for your team and have them just focus on the game? Well, here's, here's the problem with our team, all right? There's two things. One is we are absolutely forbidden to embellish anyone. Our teammates. We've had one call this year for a diving, and that player was reprimanded for it. So we don't embellish on it. We move our feet. And we're sincere in the way we play the game. And other than that, you know what? It's our fault. We're the ones who worked so hard to establish ourselves to get some respectability last year. And uh, these guys are human. They look at the standings before the game, and they go, you know, this thing should play out a certain way. Get no respect, and it's our fault. We, uh, you know what? We, we worked so hard last year, and our situation is what it is. We have to go out and play and uh, not get wrapped up in uh, things that we can't control. Okay, good to see the power play going. That's special teams overall. Yeah, it's, uh, you know, that was a good night for our, our special team, specifically on the penalty kill. Our guys worked hard. They uh, uh, did everything we needed them to do, and uh, you know there was a, a, a lot of time that was gobbled up in, in that area in the last 24 hours. So uh, that's nice, and the power play is cooking uh, right now. And I think it's been over the course of the year when our power play has gone well. I think our uh, our team has had good success. So and Howden actually kind of caused that penalty uh, with that bull rush, the kid. Well, yeah, you know that's the only way we're going to get. Uh, 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 to go our way is to keep moving our feet and work as hard as he is and uh, putting how down some God given um, uh, speed and he's got to take advantage of that. Craig Anderson came back tonight. He was had you guys hadn't beaten him yeah, in eight games. True. Nice to, to get it a couple is, past yeah. him. Yeah, you know, that's one of those stats that you flipped through the game notes before and that one sticks out. Don't discount that he's got a home here, he works out here, he's got to quality fan base and friend base that's uh, based out of here. So good for him, but uh, even better for us to pop that bubble. And, and obviously the Sens, you guys hadn't played well against them either. With no, him, you know, we've had snapshots over the last uh, uh, while, but uh, they've had our number this year. It's nice to take a little chink off their arm. And Dimitri Kulikov now two goals in the last couple yeah, of games, both game so. winners. Yeah. yeah, and that's, uh, you know, more cool is a guy that uh, is really developing into a solid player for us. He plays on both sides of the puck. And, you know, those kind of uh, plays where you're scoring goals just add to your confidence level. So that's a good thing. Thank you.